बट द थिंग इज दैट इफ यू डू कंटिन्यूस वर्क ना वन डे विल कम वे यू गेट सेलेक्टेड ओके सो मनीष लेट मी फर्स्ट थैंक यू फॉर गिविंग योर टाइम फॉर दिस इंटरेक्शन थैंक यू सर एंड मनीष लेट मी कंग्रेचुलेट यू ऑल्सो आपकी सिलेक्शन हुई है एज मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनी इन प्रेस्टिजियस कंपनी एफ ए सी टी फैक्ट सो मनीष ये सारा इंटरेक्शन यू नो दर्पज ऑफ द इंटरेक्शन इज स्टूडेंट विल बी लिसनिंग टू यू दे गेट बेनिफिटेड बाई योर एंटायर दिस प्रोसेस एंटायर योर जर्नी सो लेट्स स्टार्ट अवर इंटरेक्शन एंड टेल अस मनीष अबाउट यू फर्स्ट आप कहाँ से हैं विच कॉलेज यू ग्रेजुएटेड फ्रॉम एंड आपकी बैकग्राउंड क्या है अकेडमिक बैकग्राउंड क्या है टेक्नोलॉजी तो आपने फैक्ट कैसे ज्वाइन कर लिया था नाइन मंथ्स लास्ट ईयर एक्चुअली सर आई हैव गिवन दैट मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनिंग एग्जाम ओके सो इन दैट ट्रेन दैट लिस्ट आई वाज इन द मैनेजमेंट ट्रेनिंग लिस्ट बट सम हाउ आई डिड नॉट गेट दैट सेलेक्टेड बिकॉज़ दैट वाज और लाइक सीट इज ओनली नाइन आई वाज इन रैंक नंबर 17 सो दे आस्क इफ यू वांट टू ज्वाइन यू वांट टू टेक द एक्सपीरियंस देन यू कम एंड यू यू कैन टेक द चांस बट ऑन कॉन्ट्रैक्ट बेसिस सो आई हैड चूजन दैट वन सो I get around nine month experience. Hmm. I think that was a very good decision क्योंकि जो आपको learn करने को मिला होगा and उसका भी interview में impact आया होगा कि मैंने nine months में यहाँ पे काम किया है right Manish? Yes, yes sir. Hmm. They ask yeah. भी all question about the my plant itself. After Achha. that something about the fertilizers basics hmm. only. अच्छा ये fact company के बारे में थोड़ा सा बताइए Manish आप fact what is this company fact? Uh, actually this uh, fertilizer and chemical treatment code that is uh, not only people are thinking that that is only fertilizer company it is not only fertilizer company apart from that they are uh, they have a business in petrochemical industries also they are making caprolactam this is the first product another product like uh, factum force this is uh, like so many products are there so in fertilizer sector one is factum force mm-hmm. then they are producing sulfuric acid nitric acid soda mm-hmm. as Hmm. Then, uh, so this T is a Travancore or what? What is the word Travancore? So only offices in Travancore for this company. Uh, all uh, everything is in the Kerala, Kochi. Hmm. Okay. So this is only in the southern part of India. This company. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. So Manish, now ये बताइए कि the what is the uh, process of getting into this is through gate only, fact? Ah uh, no, sir. Actually, they uh, before that uh, like uh, la la uh, before two years they are taking from the get. Now they are conducting their own exams. Okay, so your selection was through their exam. 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 What kind of exam is that? Uh, actually, if you are as I uh, what I think that sir, if you have reached some levels, like some level is required to clear any written exam, whether it is gate or whether any any PSU exam. So if you reach that level, then you can crack any exam. Like fact, I have cracked so many exam, but uh, problem is that before that I have taken the in- NRL interview from you also, but I got I have not get selected. Mm. Uh, finally, I got selected here. So, thing mm. is that if you are reading, uh, continuity is important. You mm. read every day. Uh, you reach that level, you will crack the exam. Mm. That Achha, is. अच्छा मेरे को मेरे को अपना थोड़ा struggle और uh, जो आपका consistency था उसके बारे में बताओ uh, Manish. जैसे आपने graduation किया उसके बाद आप तैयारी में लग गए होंगे. आपने बहुत से exam लिखे होंगे. Click नहीं कर रहा है. उसके बारे में थोड़ा सा बताएं बताएं आप. So I have completed my bachelor's in 2017. Mm. 2017. Then I had done job in uh, Indian Institute of Technology, Dhanbad, as a project associate, around day one year. Mm-hmm. After that, uh, I cleared the gate. Gate. Then uh, I chosen that M Tech from Indian Institute of Technology mm-hmm. from 2018 to 2020. Mm-hmm. After that, 2020, I don't have any job opportunity anywhere. So mm-hmm. uh, in between, I also given the so many exam. Mm-hmm. I just cleared the exams like uh, NRL is there, Cool India is there. and then uh, other exams are there i have clear but uh, anyhow i am not able to clear the that interview mm-hmm. that was the key thing that i have not able to clear 
<laughs> so i was continuously giving the exam uh, in between i have chosen that uh, i can apply for the uh, pg also so i have given the pg interview for indian institute of technology kharagpur then mm. patna then iit dhanbad so i clear all that phd interview then mm. i thought uh, uh, this is real, this is real my dream so i think that it is better uh, what you want to do you can do it so i th- so again i have given the exams like uh, a gate i have scored good rank but uh, in 2020 no seats were there in iucl mm. around 15 or something my rank was around 196 all india but i have mm. not selected there so mm. seats were not there then i was frustrated that if even i have scored that much good rank but i am not getting mm. jobs but still mm. i have given the exam i have given the fsct exam then uh, somehow they ask if you want to join in contract basis you can come so i joined as a contract basis then after i given the exam and finally i got selected हम्म ओके अच्छा मनीष मेरे को ये बताओ 17 से लेके 22 अभी 22 में आपका जॉब लगा है तो पांच साल आपने बताया कि मैंने एज अ प्रोजेक्ट एसोसिएट भी काम किया बीटेक के बाद तो हाउ कुड यू गेट आफ्टर बीटेक ओनली दिस प्रोजेक्ट एसोसिएट पोजीशन एक्चुअली दैट एडवर्टाइजमेंट केम सर सो आई हैव सीन दैट एडवर्टाइजमेंट अराउंड दिस प्रोजेक्ट इज बेसिकली बेस्ड ऑन द कोल इंडिया इट इज अ यूज ऑफ कोल एंड पेट्रो इन द सीमेंट इंडस्ट्री इन इंडिया as a chemical engineer we read about the coal so i i went for the interview somehow interview done well for me so i got selected so i thought mm. we'll join there i joined then they said that it is better for you to join the mtech if you clear the gate mm. then i clear the gate then they they ask you to uh, you can do the mtech under me so i have done the mtech also mm. like that and then 2021 i have uh, actually i joined the it kharagpur also as a phd mm. but i dropped uh, in 2021 mm-hmm. so okay i don't want to continue phd mm-hmm. because my family background is not that strong mm-hmm. so i want to support my family so i choose an fsct after that mm-hmm. finally I... okay manish now coming to fact uh, fsct uh, uh, tell us in detail about the entire experience interview experience kya stages thi how was the experience of interview of fact we uh, the process started with the written exam Mm-hmm. so after uh, like they conducted the written exam after the written exam they have given the response you can check and challenge if you want so after that uh, everything will be over they shortlisted uh, number of people like 18 seats are there so they ask into five like 90 people for the interview mm-hmm. so interview have two parts one is a group discussion and mm-hmm. last one is the personal interview mm-hmm. so group discussion they conducted a group discussion in a very good manner Mm. like in my group discussion uh, 12 people was there mm. so they asked uh, each and every one to give it, they have given the time around 5 minutes to everyone to speak about that then they will start the uh, real discussion then after that you conclude like some out of 12 one people will conclude and they have also given the paper where you have to write what what are the conclusion from your group mm. so that is a good thing and the topic uh, i believe the topic was uh, is india is ready for uh, 5g This is the topic. Is India mm. is ready for the 5G? Mm. The topic. Then uh, my DD was very well. And after that interview, the interview that was a group discussion, right? It was group discussion. Group discussion. Uh, group task was not there, Manish. Uh, only group discussion. So, how many people were in group discussion? Me? Ah, uh, twelve people. And how long did it take, Manish? Around one hour, sir. Hmm. Uh, DD, one hour was running. Ah, actually, sir, uh, when we went there, na. so mm-hmm. they have uh, demonstrated five uh, five minutes of what are the thing they are looking after mm-hmm. that they have given five minute to everyone like 12 people around 12 into 5 five five minute har koi bole two minutes sorry sir two minutes two minutes mm-hmm. then they started the discussion uh, open the discussion for everyone mm-hmm. so they give around 15 minutes mm-hmm. then Achha, after you thought unhone shuru mein instructions kya diya tha manish what were the instruction if you remember uh, they said that uh, uh like uh, we uh, we are here to check the communication skills first thing is that uh, you should be good uh, uh, you should be a leader first they said that you should be good in communication skill uh, you should give your valid point you should support uh, if somebody is not able to tell something and you should not look us uh, you should discuss uh, in yourself and uh, if possible uh, make eye contact on each other and uh, after uh, like uh, they said that don't create the uh, like noise like situation and behave like gentlemen discuss whatever the point is there even if you are not uh, 
like if you don't uh, support anyone but don't make a noise that is the crucial point then they said that everyone should be come with the conclusion what are the what finally you should con- come with the conclusion what is the conclusion uh, you should not create the chaos that way you cannot able to tell what are the conclusion of your group uh, so these are the point they said and they said that uh, the last you have to write the conclusion in the paper also Mm-hmm. so that also contains uh, contains some up and this point should be consist of everyone not you you should not write your point only you also write what other people said so these are the point they said hmm okay acha to aapne jab se sabne start kar diya chaos nahi phaila because 12 number is supposed to be uh, on the larger side you know group for group yes, <laughs> so actually they have some people was there na so they had deviated but deviated the topic completely Mm-hmm. the topic is about the 5g connectivity so two three people were talking about that uh, the 5g should not come uh, because if 5g will come then our uh, product uh, like uh, food product will be there uh, like uh, taken this topic and diverted to that uh, farmer side fertil- fertilizer side of something mm-hmm. so chaos was there huge chaos was there mm-hmm. but finally anyhow we have to conclude now everything acha fir gd ke baad sabko pass kar dete hain matlab wo sabko allow karte hain interview jaane ke liye and uh, that is uh, that is on uh, that is uh, they allowed everyone they have not rejected anyone mm-hmm. but much um, more they have given uh, uh, those who have given a good gd have get the good uh, getting the good marks mm-hmm. so abhi now after gd then uh, we went to manish uh, interview so how was the interview uh, interviews is, for me is great mm-hmm. uh, actually i think five people was there mm-hmm. uh, first was the lady hr Mm-hmm. then after one people is from uh, some technical university they are only mm-hmm. asking about the technical question mm-hmm. we uh, first ask about my mtech project and then you know, what are that mean what are the advantages what are the thing that is new uh, and then uh, they ask about the basic definitions uh, of technical question then two people uh, two, one people is there they are asking about my plan uh, what are the plant uh, what about the distributed control system how we are maintaining the product what is the startup and what is the shutdown activity what as engineer what, what is your role mm-hmm. and how you handle the uh, situation when something uh, something wrong happens then mm-hmm. last one is uh, ask about then one more people is there He is asking about uh, as an engineer, what do you suggest the improvement in which area, like in energy sector or in which sector? If you want, if you have any suggestion that we can optimize this process, so you can uh, give us. So only uh, this. Then one people only ask about the fertilizers, hmm. like what are the basic fertilizers, like how ammonia will be produced, what is the raw material of hydrogen, what is green hydrogen, hmm. what is the uh, what is the blue hydrogen, what is the urea. Mm-hmm. then what is factum 4 mm-hmm. what are the imports of fsct mm-hmm. then uh, they ask about uh, the which uh, fertilizers like so many fertilizers are there na so why people are using only urea not the factum 4 like uh, complex fertilizers npk mm-hmm. because uh, the pro- because the government is giving more subsidy on that mm-hmm. uh, urea compared to other Mm-hmm. so this ask about the basic fertilizer question then sulfur they have also sulfuric acid plant na mm-hmm. one critical question they ask about that ammonia mm-hmm. in ammonia like we have to maintain a very high pressure mm-hmm. 1000 atm or something mm-hmm. so they ask about the why you are not using uh, multiple reactor why you are using the single reactor single reactor we are generally using single reactor because of very high pressure mm-hmm. we don't want to waste that material construction cost or something आपको क्या लगता है टॉपर बिकॉज वी हैल पीपल देम वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट वॉट मार्क्स दे आर गेटिंग सेकेंड पॉइंट लाइक इंटरव्यू रिटर्न वेटेज वॉज एटी फाइव परसेंट Mm-hmm. and the remaining is 15% mm-hmm. so even if my interview was not good uh, i will mm-hmm. select you get selected mm-hmm. okay. mm-hmm. so in interview all thing work was the my experience they have mm-hmm. all everything ask about my experience whether uh, you have done your job in plant you have learned the thing or me or just wasting your time there that is mm-hmm. the crucial point for me to jo 9 months mein aapne 9 months mein sikha tha entire questions were related to that only they ask, they ask everything they know each and every line about that mm-hmm. okay Hmm. So Manish, abhi, uh, aapka jo location hai, where you will be located after yeah. this Sir, in the Kerala in Udyog Mandal complex. Udyog Mandal, where is that in Kerala? It is in uh, it is uh, in ten kilometers up, uh, away from the Alua railway station. 
अराउंड टेन किलोमीटर अच्छा हम्म सो सो व्हेन इज द जॉइनिंग दे आर गिविंग यू माय मेडिकल वाज डन आई थिंक इट इन दिसंबर फर्स्ट वीक दे विल गिव यू हम्म एवरीथिंग विल डन सर बस ओनली सम सम करेक्टर सर्टिफिकेट और समथिंग वी हैव टू सबमिट दैट एट टाइम हम्म ओके एवरीथिंग इज डन Mm. So Manish, now any advice you want to give to students who are in the process of you know preparation and getting selected into public sector? Which one? I you want to give? I just want to say one thing, sir. Uh, when I uh, since I was passed out in two thousand seventeen, I have given so many exams, but I have not able to clear the interview. Mm. So I was thinking that whether I will get this job or not. Mm. But the thing is that if you do continuous work, na mm. one day will come where you get selected. So lage rehna chahiye matlab. लगे रहना चाहिए दैट इज इंपॉर्टेंट मोटिवेट होके लगे रहो एंड वन डे विल बी योर डे हां लाइक दिस ईयर सो मेनी वैकेंसीज आर देयर नेक्स्ट ईयर आल्सो वैकेंसी विल बी देयर इफ यू हैव अ कंटिन्यूटी इन स्टडी यू विल गेट डेफिनेटली यू विल गेट हां बच्चे डीमोरलाइज हो जाते हैं जैसे छोड़ देते हैं तैयारी वगैरह तो उनको डीमोरलाइज नहीं होना चाहिए लगे रहना चाहिए तैयारी करते रहना चाहिए मनीष एंड वन डे यू विल गेट अ गुड अपॉर्चुनिटी यस सर ऐसा ही होता है रियलिटी यही है देयर इज लगे Chalo Manish it was wonderful talking to you and uh, let me wish you all the very best for your career ahead and i'm very sure you are going the kind of attitude you have for life the like consistency or uh, effort you will surely grow in your life manish so wish you all the very best for your career thank you sir thank you okay